I wrote to both uh, Sir Manuel and Lady Cathy. I thank both of them for their stellar service with respect to the last positions they held. I went on in the case of Sir Manuel uh, to make the point that this was, of course, just part of a larger trajectory, a larger historical background that fixes him firmly in the national consciousness as an exemplary public servant, as an exemplary politician, an exemplary prime minister. I expressed my regret at his departure but made clear that in the circumstances I understood and, and that's where I would leave it. Was there, do you feel that you should have intervened to, to save his, his daughter's job or to make her have a more orderly departure? I won't get into that. Um, I really believe that what's happened has happened and it involves certainly the Minister of Tourism, a member of my cabinet, and a process that he certainly believes was a fair and transparent one. I am not going to go beyond that. The question of the details is very important, and I don't know that I would agree with the term uh, push out. But really, I'm not going to add sauce to the stew. Uh, I've said what I've just said about how grateful I continue to be uh, to Sir Manuel and that I regret the fact that he leaves in these circumstances, but what it is, is what it is. Will you continue to reach out to him to, to be an active part of the UDP, if not your government? Well, that's a standing invitation, if you will. That's a standing arrangement, um, and it's entirely up to Sir Manuel to determine uh, what, if any, role he will play with respect to the party that he led so well uh, for such a long time.